uh, let's get started with uh, West of Loathing. I didn't start it uh, at the title screen, but who cares? We're going to get started anyway. <laughs> Yay! Oh, I can finally let back. my voice rest. Oh, what's up, man? Hey, Captain. Oh, hey, George. Hey, Clojan. Hey, um, no. uh, both of you. Um, have you guys seen the, the image I sent now? No. I just noticed it. You got Top Gear Rally, Battle Tanks, with an X. And Wave Racer! Yep, yeah, I finally bought a new 64. Also, I think it's time to reveal you guys what I got, what is inside that mystery box. Oh. Are you guys ready? Is it legal? Sure. It might be, but I don't know. <laughs> it might be, okay. Okay, let's see. There, I send it I send it now. Alright, let's see. I better be I better be impressed. Trust me, my brother told me this is much longer than this one. I can't say it. Oh there it is. That's just a spot. I, I, help I got some. Eh, seven out of ten. Eh, I figured. <laughs> I'm gonna find another one. Because apparently my brother said this, really? the other person the they saw, it was much taller and much heavier than the other. Ah, I so see. So I'm, like, I'm excited to go back to Comic Con again. Wait, also, Captain, what do you mean from, uh, you're jealous? Which one you're talking about? What? Um, you're just, said that you're jealous. I'm, I'm just joking. Oh. All right, fight him or surrender. I'll flip a coin. Oh no, fight him or surrender. Oh wait, I need to read the first. Uh, One thing for sure, my parents are gonna kill me for this. <laughs> There's a sudden yeah, thrilling no. whoosh sound, and a man dressed all in dark gray with a long flappy cloak and gray bandana, pull up to conceal his face, appears before you out of the shadows. He brandishes a wicked-looking knife. As you, uh, at you accusing me. Stop right there. Prove your allegiance, for I'll suffer no cultist in this place. Could you be more specific? The necromancer's cultist. The skeleton guys. Sonny Jim, if you're calling us skeleton cultists, you're gonna be eating those words with a side order of teeth. Alright, let's fight him. I actually wanna get right. some, uh, some, some, uh, yeah. XP from that. Okie dokie. Oh man! <laughs> and he has poison. Uh, let's see. <laughs> My gun does absolutely nothing to this guy. Uh, oh wow, yeah, this guy is tough. Okay. Let uh, me do the good old one too on him. There we go. Good thing you're a puncher. Yeah. Ah. Take that! <laughs> I'm just gonna keep on ignoring you. <laughs> Okay. We should be okay now. Got him. There we go. You beat the guy up, but stop short of killing him, since this is basically just a big misunderstanding at all. You gain 43 EXP, and you get a repurposed cult dagger. Actually, I want to see if that's good or not. This, this curvy dagger has a hollow hilt full of poison. Those cultists fight dirty. Uh, 12 to 5, 15 damage applies 3 poison to enemy. Ooh, wait, what, what is it? Let me see my, my big bone over here. Uh, Ooh. well no, that's that's the bloody cleaver. Where's the bone Down, at? down, down. Oh yeah, down, it's, down. it's stronger than the bone. 
you'll lose two muscle and uh, maximum and at maximum HP though. So it's just, so it's a matter of if you think you can deal enough damage. Yeah, we'll do it. There we go. All right, let's see. Pile of weird rocks. These rocks are strange. They don't seem to weigh as much as they should, and are sort of drawn to each other. You can probably make an interesting uh, Karen or whatever that is, out of them. All right, you want something powerful, mystical, or suave? Yeah, uh, let's set it up there. I forgot to set it up before we started. <laughs> roll, 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 roll. I did always two. <laughs> mystical, okay. A perfectly balanced stack. There we go. You step back and admire your head. It's very organized. <laughs> okay. Um, this place, I if I remember correctly, is kind of a. Uh, you have to come here for end game stuff. Um. Yeah, they they have to be a specific uh, thing with the highest the traits on all. I, I believe. So, not much we can really do here. Let me see. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, Alright, let's, let's go over here, I guess. Willow takes a shortcut through what you ta uh, take to be an old cow graveyard. Suddenly, the entire graveyard worth of bones clatters together into a giant antagonistic pillar of evil. Wait a minute, but they're made of bones! <laughs> Looks like the sausage Oh no, wait, that's a rib. Oh wow, I can, I can one-shot this thing. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust, pillar of cow bones to pile of pulverized cow bones. Now you got a, an unglith horn and a brass bull ring. Alright, let's see, what did we get from that? Oh, it's just something to be sold. Years of being stuck in the nose of a cow have done nothing for the finish of this thing, alright. Oh, so you just sell, sell the, the cow remains, gotcha. All right. Uh, let's be cartwheel over here. Ooh, he must have sleepwalked here. All right, cool. That guy hasn't stopped messing it with his watch and started eating jelly beans. Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> what you got there, jelly beans? Yep. Can I have one? No. <laughs> uh, do you want to say please, or where'd you get him? <laughs> well, I got the two shot of dice, dude. All right, go for it. One. Ooh. Please. No, get your own. <laughs> 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 Okay, let's do it again. Oh, wait, where'd you get him? Okay. <clears throat> no, but I'm scared. Okay. Oh. A little way south here from fellow named Roy Bean. You discover a new map location. Roy Bean's House of Justice and Jelly Beans. Mike. This lady is still whistling to the beat of the band. Ew. Howdy, boss. Howdy. It's me. Stuck again? Yep, got ourselves one hell of a canyon to get across. And no materials for bridge building. Any ideas? There's an old mine in town up north called Breadwood. They opened a lumber camp after mines dried up. If we can fix a deal with them for lumber we need, I can handle the engineering side of things. Okay, where is it? 
me marks the location of the Breadwood camp on your map. You discover Breadwood. Of course, anything you can find to build a bridge out of is just fine by me. But that seems like the simplest option. <laughs> I hope you're I'll ready. See what I can do. I hope you're ready for suffering, because this is what <laughs> lies ahead of us. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, ooh, let's go to the bean, the <laughs> the beans. Beans. The already intense heat intensifies. Sweat stings your eyes, and while it's stinging them, you fail to use them to notice that you've ridden right into the middle of a herd of uh, pyrobos, whatever that is. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, those! Whoa! Whoa! Well, I'm dead. You're dead. The pyro rolls roast you and leave you for dead in a nearby ditch. You gain, in effect, angry. Oh, well. Doc Alice slings you across Willow's back and you continue down the trail. Okay, well, that definitely itself is going to be bad. Oh. What's up, Doc? Eat a carrot. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh! Uh, uh, what's up? Is there another cemetery in the area we need to check out? Yeah, but you might say that. Definitely, there's a cemetery-ish thing. Definitely, we need to check it out. Well, that doesn't sound ominous at all. You discovered a new location, the Buffalo Pile. Okay, <laughs> well, let's check out this first. We're already here. Ooh, toilet! <laughs> what is this thing even hooked up to? Flush and see. Hold on, George. Roy, Roy must prefer to perform his morning uh, ambulations outdoors. You gussy up a bit, and you gain 5 XP. Alright, cool. Ooh, nice. Out in that pilgrim. Name's Roy Bean. <laughs> That's gonna be hard. Hello, Roy. I'm Jack John. What do you do here? Well, when I first came to these parts, I was all about two things. Dispensing justice and dispensing jelly beans. I was the biggest name in bounty hunting and candy selling anyone ever heard of. Gosh, what happened? Oh, nothing particularly tragic. Got old is all. Hung up my pistol for good. He points to, he points to the wall. <laughs> He's pointing at an empty hook on the wall, over a spittoon. I still sell some jelly beans from time to time, but they're all out on fashion. This whole place is just a jelly bean museum now. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that hurts my throat so much. <laughs> Which one do we say? It seems like a sign in out front is, isn't very accurate then. Ask about the jelly beans? Uh, you can ask about the jelly beans. For a jelly bean museum, I sure don't see many jelly beans. Well, a bunch of crooks and shady characters stole them. All three jars. Suppose you think I'm soft target now that I'm tired. Gosh, that sucks. That looks like this is a side quest for uh, getting them back. Alright, then I guess I'll help you get them back. Well, now I certainly appreciate the assistance. Uh, can't offer much in the way of reward. But I can tell you which way the first group of thieves went. If you're happening out that direction, you discover a new map location: Jelly Bean Thieves Hideout. <laughs> okay, yeah, not for sale. <laughs> Ooh, oh, I can't even interact with that. Okay, whoops. You can't interact with this platoon. Ooh, okay. There's a single yellow jelly bean in this case, with a sign that says Paragonia. Murder bee honey jelly bee. Very rare. 6,000 meat. What kind of lunatic would pay 6,000 meat for a single jelly bee? <laughs> Not this kind, that's for sure. It's a spittoon. Nothing special about it. As soon as you get near the spittoon, you can smell the overpoweringly sweet stench it excludes. Nauseating sweet 
like the rotting corpse of a dead gummy bear. <laughs> Look inside. Garnish rainbow colors swirl around in a congealing psychedelic madness. Is Roy using jelly beans as chewing tobacco? Yes, yes, of course he is. And investigate further. We're talking about a bowl of jelly beans that have been stuck on, half chewed, and then spat into the brass bucket. Do you seriously want to put your hands in the swill of an artificial coloring and thicken saliva? It will probably never be cleaned again. Go for it. Look, I'm serious. You're about to be permanently tie your hand with a swirling mishmash of all the worst colors in the spectrum. No one would ever tattoo that looks as gross or as stupid. Give it to me. Well, I tried. Don't say I didn't warn you. You plunge your hand into the spittoon and fish around for a while. Eventually, you pull out a really disgusting pistol and a really disgusting hand to shoot it with. You got a perk, spittoon hand. And you also got befouled pistol. <laughs> Alright, let's see what the let's see what the pistol is. Um <laughs> It'll probably make up a two sound when you shoot it. <laughs> Deal stench damage instead of physical damage. Uh <laughs> physical oh, Plus it's it's, Ooh. Thirteen as uh, seventeen? How, what are my pistols right now? Oh, that's already stronger. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, my gun does extra damage against cows and other demonic creatures, but the befouled pistol does so much. <laughs> what are the other perks of the gang six gun? Uh, plus one moxie, deals extra damage, and it's just... Silver plated. Yeah. Hmm. So it's still got the moxie, but... Well, eh, we're we're bound hmm. to upgrade pistols anyway. So, and I hardly use the pistols because we know. can bring back the, the gang six gun when we're in a situation. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Ooh, jelly bean thief hideout. That's not too far from here. You see a few, a few buildings off in the distance and spur Willow towards them to investigate. It turns out to be an old Kellogg san, uh, sanatorium. You remember reading about this place in the papers. Crazy guy obsessed with bodily and spiritual purity, charging rich people an arm and a leg to eat bad food for a few weeks. You discovered a new map location, Kellogg Ranch. Uh, let's keep going where we're going. We can't get too many distractions. Oh, wow. They all don't look like they're happy. You approach the bandit, seated around the fire. The meanest looking one speaks up. Yep. Don't know where you, where you guys think you are, stranger, but uh, you, you better turn yourself right around and head back to the way you came. Unless you want to eat lead. <laughs> uh, sorry, uh... Oh. Well, that's not very neighborly. Take a hike! Neighbor, you fellas stole a jar of jelly beans from an old man, and I aim to have them back. Oh, was that right? And just how are you planning on doing that? Okay, we had two options: honorable or with violence. <laughs> well, I think I already got the two coin. Coin flip. flip. Out. Coin flip. What? Oh, with words. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Listen, fellas. Stole a jar candy from an old man. This is such a small, petty, sad crime, it barely even qualifies as a crime. If, if this ends up on a water poster, you're gonna be the last stock of the criminal community. More importantly, what you what would your mother's think? I'm giving you a chance to turn away from this line of crime before it's too late. And I suggest you take it because I'm pretty sure this is not the life you did do. The bandits hang their heads shamefully and shuffle away. <laughs> hey, let's be. <laughs> no, hold up. I need to. I need to get some EXP on. All right, we got 294 at the moment. Considering that those cows rocked us. 
Uh, I think we need to get some speed up in here. Um, what's speed again? The tougher you'll be... Oh, the quicker, it's gumption. Uh, let's see, yeah, speed plus six. Let's get a little bit of that. And then, uh, let's see. Haymaker. Uh, let's see, AP cause. Uh, still for one round. Uh, menacing move. Tough customer. Oh, cool, we can upgrade that. Uh, melee attack damage just goes up just for no reason. Okay, cool. Uh, Dickerin, okay, thick skin. Oh, we probably could use some thick skin. So just remind me, we could start investing in uh, a lot of thick skin, because armor is going to be very important. <laughs> uh, as far as I know, it's only going up, it's up to five right now. Okay. Oh, there's probably still more here. Oh, yeah, like this over here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, get those jelly beans. Oh, yeah. It's the missing jelly beans. Mint, mint jelly bean. The bandits' meager food supply. They should have been robbing grocery stores. You got Vena blood sausage and plum pudding and clove drops. A catch of ill-gotten goods. You got another needle, cheap whiskey, and Kurt's fit headband. This is a headband formerly worn by the exercise-obsessed lunatic. It has Kurtzfit TM printed on it so many times that it's legible from every possible angle. Oh look, speed and maximum HP. That counts as like a... I mean... I mean, I mean, that, that does a lot for a hat. I'll put it on. Mm. <laughs> uh, you got a handful of nails, hog oil, and cheap wine, as well as 202 meat. Yay! Oh. This crate's full of dynamite. Ooh, we got 10 dynamite sticks. That's very good. I think it's funny. Alright, good, good, good. I think that's everything. Nothing here? Okay. Whoops. Alright, let's go give it back to Roy over here. Alright, goody. How did Jackie recover that jar of jelly beans by any chance? You heard him. Well, I'll be. Thank you kindly, Jack. I won't ask for details, but I hope there were sufficiently there were sufficiently grisly. Now the second jar of jelly beans was stolen by a basil of them weird goblin fellas. Couldn't understand a word they were saying, but they were very insistent. Where which way did they go, George? Northwest towards Oops, oh, well, okay, well, guess I <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> I misclicked A button. <laughs> You've crossed paths with the wandering Sally yet again. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> My voice is all shot from that dude. Alright, let's see. Uh, ooh, we can finally afford that safe cracking for modern saves now. It's gonna wipe us out financially, but... I mean, it's better getting it now than later. Let me go ahead and sell some stuff I don't need. <laughs> like the sugar guns. <laughs> uh, let's see what else. I have things I could sell just for, for sake of it. Uh, pretty sure I have some like money stuff. Gold tooth. Oh, unrefined meat nugget, yeah. In the striped hat that nobody wants, I'll sell that. I'm surprised we didn't sell it earlier. Uh, nasty ring. No, I have that on me. <laughs> the goblin pistol. Nah, that's. Oh that's... yeah, the goblin items. 
could sell these things. These are awful. Uh, let's see. Brown boots. No, I have those equipped. Uh, I'm going to hold on to the silver nuggets just for reasons. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's good enough for now. Oh, let's open up that book. <laughs> this book outlines the techniques for opening the safes without knowing the combination. This skill will come handy if you ever encounter a safe whose combination isn't screwed onto a nearby wall. <laughs> you quickly memorize the entire book. You got the skill, safe bracket. I'll get cracking. When you're done reading it, you lock it up in a safe that turns out to be slightly too difficult for you to crack. So it's gone forever. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, right where we were going. You see what you take to be an oasis of boiling heat of this region and spur will towards it. As you near it, you discover that you've been fooled. It wasn't an oasis at all, but an evil towering black stone cow monolith. Anyone can make that mistake, really. Yeah, if only we still had that gun. Hopefully this is too weak like the other pillar. Alright, let's see. 110? Let's see. Oh, I I, I can uh, I can do some huge damage to it. I can kill it in one shot. Good thing you're a cow puncher. Yee. Well, it didn't save me from those, uh, those other cows. <laughs> You shattered the obsidian monstrosity, but good. Uh, we got more stuff. Menudo, Geode. Look at the size of that thing. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, excuse me. The guard blocks your path. Hey! I had no climbing for humans! Well. Time to flip the coin! Okay. I hope it's one. <laughs> Just brute force our way in. Hits. That means punch. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, he has a cactus melee weapon. Oh wow, my my uh my one-two punch isn't doing that much for him. Hmm. Yeah, I knew I should have told you to get that punch that bomb. Interesting. Okay. How much damage is he gonna do to me? That, that's a big factor in everything. Ooh. Okay. Okay. That's not too bad. Blow up, but cannot heal. Oh no, oh no, not my healer! Why did I shout? Why did I shout? Uh, let's see. <laughs> uh. That poison damage is gonna ripple pretty fast. Um, I can afford one more hit of that. I can afford one more hit from that, I think. Dynamite. Yeah. <laughs> Very fortunate we got the dynamite when we did. You won. Now you can do all the climbing you want. You got goblin coffee, quote unquote. Twice. This is a cup of hot dirt juice goblins referred to as coffee. 
It increases your speed by 10, but reduces your muscle by 5 for the rest of the day. 10 reach. Wow, okay. There's another goblin here, blocking another ladder. Oh, okay, you know what? Uh, let me see what's over here first. There's a gash in the wall of cactus here, revealing a vein of sticky purple goo. A pile of goblin junk. Alright, guess we're fighting this guy. You know who we probably could have got some with those. True. Alright, let's see if we can take it on this guy. Oh, he has a gun. <laughs> oh, my one two works on this guy. Oh, wow. Too late. No wonder. <laughs> I stabbed him right through the heart. <laughs> you won. Here to play. The ladder is yours. More goblin coffee. All right, hold up. Uh, keep pushing that button. Uh, let's let's get some of that uh, defense. Um, uh, thick skin. Thick there skin. we go. Uh, next, next is gonna be seven armor. Okay. Oh, you got a perk. Mostly scabs. Oh, finally happened. You've been poked so many times, cactuses that you're, by by so many cactuses that your body has built up an extra set of skin caterpillaries just to deal with the consistent tiny puncture wounds. Plus five, maximum HP. Yo, oh, that's oh, good. Got two and a half over here. Oh, come on. Just want to see what's going on. This table is covered with flasks, beakers, bottles, tubes, burners. <clears throat> Use my normal voice for a little while. <laughs> and all other equipment that makes up a super elaborate alchemy table. Including a whole bunch of different colored liquids and powders and stuff. Leave one of them not alone. All right. Time to die. Guess that corn cooker for all. Yep, that was gonna decide everything. Uh, okay. Hiya! <laughs> all right. Whoa! Good thing it was us. It wasn't us. <laughs> Sorry, Doc. <laughs> you won. <laughs> that goblin has guarded their last ladder. You got goblin short pants and goblin uh, absin absinthe. Sure, let's go with that. <laughs> okay, what's this? Goblin absinthe is like human absinthe, but with the proportions all mixed up to make it far more dangerous. Increases your mysticality by 10, but reduces your moxie and muscle by 5 for the rest of the day. Okay, cool. Some goblin fashion mogul made their pants by taking some different pants and ripping the bottom of the legs off of them. They're ugly, but they really don't restrict your movement. <laughs> but your moxie That's tanks. <laughs> Here. Yeah, one maximum AP and four speed. Uh, anytime that there's a subtraction, I, I tend not to go for it. Whoa. Uh. You can't get the jelly beans because all the flailing goblin limbs on the pile. You should be able to get in there if you can get rid of at least 10 more goblins worth of mass or distract them somewhere. <laughs> Holy crap, if this isn't the most disturbing thing you've ever seen, I don't want to know what that was. Hey, uh, guys, these jelly beans, can I having them? Oh, what are fruit rocks? No! No, not taking our fruit rocks. These belong ours. Not for you taking. Can you get Goblin off and fight it? Pop three up? You know, I think let's just gauge to see how strong these guys are. I want to see how strong these are. XP. True, true. Um, oh wow, we're not doing much to this guy. Uh, 
let's see. Hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll do this. Hmm. My gun does more damage to this thing. But the poison, though. Ah, but it, yeah, the poison's not gonna matter that much anyway. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> I'm in danger! <laughs> uh, let's see. I'll check one of these. How much health do I have? 115, okay. We'll see just how much I have to handle. Oh, okay. I can handle more. Three of them. Well, crap. Oh! I told you three. Oh, I th well, I thought you meant like three. <laughs> okay, never mind. A whole bunch of goblin arms pick you up and pitch you out of the window. Okay, at least I didn't waste a dynamite. I'm gonna go back and and blow it up <laughs> after what it did to me. Yeah, yeah, get over here. No. Hold on, I, I'm gonna beat you guys up. Yank a goblin and fight it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, but this one, this one definitely, I can, I can one shot it. No! <laughs> they started war. <laughs> I'm going after nope, it. it. 